Mitch Evans, huge congratulations. This is a nice moment. Both of you up on the podium after what's been a bit of a torrid start uh, in the last couple of races. Congratulations. Thanks, thanks. Um, honestly, this has uh, come at a perfect time because we've had a tough start and the car's been quick. So to finally get a victory or just some solid points is, um, is incredible. So uh, a Drago one, two, three. Um, Nick pushed me all the way. We pushed each other. Both teams ex executed you know, brilliantly and this is down to all the hard work. There's a lot of craft that goes in, um, a lot of simulations, a lot of just, you know, to try and put these races together in terms of strategy is, is not easy. Um, and they got, the team guided me, you know, perfectly. And uh, yeah, I wouldn't want it much closer than that. It was incredibly close at the end. Nick has to be pushing you really hard on the last lap. Yeah, obviously it was all about track position and where you want to be at certain phases of the races. And, you know, I had a good energy advantage quite early on, but it was just trying to find my time to, to use that energy advantage. I thought maybe I went a little bit too early, but look, because um, once Nick got behind me, he was able to accumulate some energy and stick in my toe. But obviously we got the victory, so obviously we did it. We did, um, we did the right job. So, um, yeah, just super happy to, to get some, some big runs, you know, some big points on the board. All that hard work paid off. Enjoy the moment. Thanks very much. Mitch Evans. Evans taking the lead from Nick Cassidy on the run down into the first corner. Had a great fight throughout in the closing stages. The three of them were right together. And that's what it meant to James Barkley. As the three Jaguar powertrain cars came across the line to take to fill up the podium positions. Even Porsche haven't managed to do that this season. They've had two cars on the podium. James and Adrian Atkinson are celebrating together.